In this American Boat Canvas video, we'll show you how to install a cockpit cover on a Sundancer using the tools included with our free loaner installation toolkit. Arriving at the boat, we stretch out the canvas and put it in its approximate position. The fitting spikes in the toolkit snap onto the boat and hold the canvas in place, allowing you to make sure it's in the correct position before pressing any snaps. We start at the front center snap and line it up with the center seam on the canvas, pushing the canvas onto the spike and using the black cap to hold it in place. We space the spikes out every few feet, enough to hold the canvas in place. With the canvas now correctly in position, we can go back to the front and start pressing the snaps. The spike is removed and we use the chalk to mark the location of the first snap. To load the snap tool, we put the female socket on the bottom, which clicks in place. The top cap side is secured by the gray rubber grommet, holding it in place. Then, position the cap over the chalk mark and squeeze the handle to press the snap in place. With the first snap in place, we then move outward and around the sides of the boat, pressing the snaps as we go. Typically, there's a few snaps on the inside of the radar arch too. Moving back to the gunnels, the spikes are removed and the snaps are pressed. Most Sundancers use the bungees across the transom. These are already positioned and installed in the canvas from the factory. Lastly, we adjust the height of the support poles to make the canvas tight and shed rainwater. And that's about it. There's no great mystery with these cockpit covers. The fitting spikes hold everything in place so you know it's positioned correctly before pressing the snaps. For a quote on factory original canvas for your Sea Ray, visit AmericanBoatCanvas.com. Factory canvas at DIY prices.